Hey guys, it's General Heat here. How is everyone doing today? So for today's video, we're going to be showing you guys a pretty cool glitch on Halo Reach, and that is the ability to hold a machine gun turret or plasma cannon in the passenger seat of any vehicle. Uh, so this has to be done on a race game type, specifically Rocket Race, uh, I, because for some reason Halo Reach is default race game type, you can't change teams. So as you probably know, if you get out of a vehicle in race or rocket race after a few seconds you'll get teleported back onto your vehicle and if there's somebody already driving your vehicle if you're on a team then you'll get teleported to the passenger seat of the vehicle so with that in mind and before we get into this i do want to shout out halo adherence uh they're the ones that showed this to me actually and i thought it was really interesting and you know i figured i'd make a video uh of it showing it to everybody else so thank you guys and uh I'll post a link to their channel in the description of this video, so feel, definitely uh, check them out. So anyways, to do this glitch, um, you know, you just gotta do Rocket Race game type, but make sure you set it so that the uh, when you're on foot, you can actually still get on a turret, and then you can ho pick up a weapon or yank off the turret. Um, you, you also want to make sure that turrets spawn on the map. So that's all you need to do to change the settings. No other settings need to be changed. But once you pick up the turret and you're holding it, after a few seconds, you teleport to the passenger seat, as you just saw there. And once you end up in the passenger seat of the vehicle, you're still holding the turret. Uh, except you'll be uh, standing straight up here. For all intents and purposes, you're basically adding like an extra... You're adding like a gunner seat to the mongoose. Uh, and it's actually pretty useful if you do it this way. Now, unfortunately, if you play Rocket Race and matchmaking, you're not going to be able to pick up a machine gun turret because I'm pretty sure none of the maps actually have turrets on them. And even if they did, I don't think you're going to be able to pick them up either. So this is more of a thing that you can do in custom games uh, for fun and just to mess around. Now, this also works with the plasma cannon. So here with the plasma cannon, same thing, just rip the turret off and then eventually you'll teleport to the passenger seat of the mongoose and you'll be able to fire the plasma cannon just fine. Uh, one interesting thing to note about both the machine gun turret and the plasma cannon when you do this is that uh, it doesn't matter like which direction you look at, you don't have any animations when you're uh, standing up. So if you turn left or right, your character doesn't actually turn left or right with you. Uh, if, in fact, if you fire backwards, it looks you'll, you'll still be facing forward, but then you'll you'll be shooting like your bullets will be flying backwards. Uh, through like you and the, and the machine gun turret or plasma cannon, and this also works with the uh, the warthog. Uh, I've only been able to test the mongoose and the warthog, but I'm sure any vehicle with a passenger seat, it will be the same result. Uh, I just haven't, I couldn't find any um, official rocket race game types with other vehicles besides the mongoose and the warthog. But if there are other vehicles that you can use with passenger seats, then I'm sure it should have the same results as this. Um, so technically. You should theoretically you should be able to do with any vehicle with the passenger seat, um, but yeah, so that's pretty much all there is to it. You just need a you just need a rocket race game type where you can uh, pick up weapons and have machine gun turrets spawn as well. Uh, oh, and you need to make sure that you get the pass when you're on foot. You can also use vehicles and stuff. Uh, you just gotta play around the settings and get the right settings for it to work. Um, but the default settings are not gonna work because there are definitely quite a few things preventing you from. Uh, preventing like a machine gun turret from spawning or you from picking it up or yanking it off and so on uh, But yeah, so it's pretty easy glitch to do and it's pretty awesome uh, <laughs> to, to see it like this you're basically like George in campaign because if you remember in campaign when you drive uh, George around on the The other uh, civilian uh, pickup truck or something he stands on like the bed of the pickup truck and just uh, shoots his machine gun turret that way and you know you don't have the capability to do that in campaign but now with this glitch you pretty much can do it uh, in custom games, of course. But, yeah, so, there you have it, folks. And once again, I do want to thank uh, Halo Adherence for showing this to me. It's a pretty, uh, pretty awesome glitch. Um, but, yeah, so, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. And, oh, well, I forgot to mention one more thing. If you do drop the turret while you're standing up, then you'll just sit back down. Not surprising, but it just uh, wanted to mention that. And that, that stays true for any vehicle. But anyways, if you did enjoy this vehicle and found this to be pretty cool, um, you know, as always, make sure to leave a like, uh, leave your thoughts in the comments. If there's anything else for me to check out or look into, then, you know, just let me know in the comments and I'll do my best to look into it. Uh, but other than that, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.